Welcome back to the Road Show. This morning in the buzz, entertaining your kids may be reaching a whole new crazy level. <laughs> Take a look at this video. A Colorado supermarket has come up with a new way to keep your kids occupied while mom and dad shop. It's a shopping cart equipped with a small TV screen so the kiddos can watch movies while rolling up and down the aisles. But while it may keep them quiet so you can shop, is it really a good idea? All right, the question is, you think kids are becoming too dependent on technology and media to stay entertained? Hmm, what do you think, Patrick? Why'd you say it like that? I, I just, Wait, I'm just... A, I didn't install these TVs. No, because you're a parent. Mm, yeah, I'm starting with you because you do you're that? a parent. What do you think? I think it's brilliant. I think you're nuts. Well, that was before today, but yeah. <laughs> this just puts it over the top. I don't think it's... Just confirms your I think suspicion. it's not brilliant. I think it's nuts. All right, well, do you want me to go first? Yeah, go ahead. Go, go ahead. Go ahead. Okay, I think yeah. it's great because... <laughs> Having children, you bring them to the grocery store, and all they want to do is climb around in the shopping cart, stick their feet through the part where you're actually having to push it. Then, there's a, then they stand up. Then they might fall out, or they get away from the shopping cart, and they run down the aisle. They rip everything off the shelf, throw it on the floor, ba ba ba, all this stuff. Your kids are that bad at the grocery no, store? No, but I've seen kids okay. that have been doing that. That is the entertainment that should be at a grocery no, store. No, 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 no. I think this is the dumbest idea. Because here's why. Tell yeah. me why. When okay. I would go shopping with my mom or dad or, well, mainly my mom. Yeah. Um, <laughs> no, that would be so much fun. I would be so entertained in a, in a grocery store getting a piece of cheese from the deli exactly. or a cookie from the yeah, bakery. That, that, yeah, the cheese from the, okay, listen, the cheese from the deli trick lasts about <laughs> nine seconds. No, but That's it's cool but until you get to the first aisle. Is, but the thing is, too, people are getting swept up in the grocery stores. Like, literally, kids are being taken or mm -hmm. pushed away. Now you have a TV screen in front of a kid, and the, ca and the cart just starts moving, and here's a kid just thinking, okay, mom's pushing me again, and it's really some kid thing. Well, that's him. a parenting problem, and that has nothing to do with no, TV. I'm just screen. saying, we are becoming, becoming people that could get to that level. You've got TVs in cars. You've got TVs in waiting rooms. You've got TVs everywhere. It's like... The, I can tell you when I think it's appropriate, and again, this is parents out there maybe like, be quiet, Danielle. Four hour ride to Vermont, appropriate. You can watch a movie, you play your handheld game for a little while, but then guess what? You're driving through the white mountains of New Hampshire and Look you're looking outside. at the splendor of nature. Guess what? Turn it off. And oh I'm sorry, God. at the you, supermarket. You are delusional. No, you I think am not delusional. You think a seven year old kid is wondered about the. What did you call it of nature? The splendor of the nature. The splendor of nature. I admit. Splenda is something you put in your coffee. But anyway. <laughs> I admit they were a little like, what? I'm what? like, just look at the mountain. My parents look would say Look at where to me, the old man on the mountain used to be. I guess it just, used to be, by the way. Yeah. Oh, my yes. mom and dad used to say, look at the foliage. Well, you know, I, I can't even spell foliage. Yeah, but did you need a TV back then? No, also? we had the Watchman, the first little TV. Remember the Watchman, how? that one channel? And you played it the whole time. Hey, but how TV, long you are you it. in the supermarket for? An are you hour? really in the supermarket for that long? An hour? Kayla, wait like, till you have my hand. I am so in agreement till, with you. Listen, Absolutely here's ridiculous. the one who, when she's on vacation, says, I can't believe I'm on Facebook and I'm on vacation. You post That's those different, things. Though. Oh, technology for adults is okay. Yeah, but you I'm not, that I'm not sitting there cruising this one. Look through. At this. She can't even get on the set updating. without a little handheld no. device to check them on who is. I'm done. Oh, I'm done. Let's see. Done. So and so is my friend on Facebook. Pa, pa, pa. You can't get through three hours done. on the news without that That's thing. That's so ridiculous. It's so not the same thing. What's the difference? When an adult oh, you want to call a spade a spade here. You on the set about to do <laughs> a here. story. This and you're like, getting out of and control. you're like, this is getting it's out, out of here. But, but no, I, I, ha, sometimes, ha, on the set sometimes today. kids will start to become even more and more dependent on the technology. They are. They Danielle doesn't watch watches are. TV no on this thing all morning while she's on TV. He is lying. There's no escape. Should I go to the grocery store today, honey? Because I have my black needs to save us. To from check ourselves. Out all my text messages. Stop it. Save me from this. <laughs> it's so hard because my position's technology driven too. So, I mean, uh, but, but this is different. We're talking technology. about in the supermarket, <laughs> TVs and shopping carts. Good idea, not. A good idea, but um, lots of people don't like it. We have a few who are okay with it, so we'll start on the live blog on foxprovidence.com. And uh, Smokey says, I think this is a good idea to keep the kids busy while we shop. They always get so bored and want everything in the store, so I think it'll be a good idea for the kids to keep them occupied. And one artist said, shopping for food is an important skill the kids should learn. Treating them to TV in the cart sounds cool, but what are they learning? 
Here's the poll right underneath the live blog on our homepage. Do you think kids are becoming too dependent on technology? A, yes, and they're disconnecting from society, or B, no, not if it's monitored by parents. We have about nine or so comments on our Facebook page this morning, and Leslie Anderson says, whatever happened to looking around at your environment, whether in a car or a store? And Christine says, I absolutely agree that technology has taken over. I think it's a bit over the top to put TV screens on shopping carts. And Tina says, this is called lazy parenting. My kids love to go shopping. They learned addition, subtraction, nutrition, etc. So uh, lots of comments here this morning. But if you feel that you like it and you think it's a good idea, you can weigh in in our poll and we'll have those results for you at the end of the show.